Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back. I know it's been a little while, but I figured I should put a video out regarding the new update, the week one quest, uh, as well as the week two quest, and just a general update synopsis kind of thing. First off, we're going to go over codes. There is a code called Halloween22 with an exclamation mark at the end, all caps. This will give you three pumpkin boxes. Uh, the other ones are Wow Spooky Day in all lowercase, no spaces, and this should give you two pumpkin boxes, and then we have too many bugs due to the bug gear release last night, and this will give you a magnificent box, as you can see here. I don't know regarding exotics and stuff, so uh, I will check now to see if there's any exotics in the, uh, the loop here. Give me a minute. This happened my second box. So it seems that there are no new um, exotics in the loop, but yeah. Alright, as far as the week one quest goes, as you can see here, I am about to finish it, but pretty much all you do is you run around and kill the zombies that spawn. You will know the zombie has spawned because in the chat it will say a horde of guardians have approached. So we pretty much just wait for that to happen, and then boom, we are done. So as you can see, I'm now finished with the 10-3 plague quest. We will now move on to the uh, Famine of Desikar quest. This is a much faster to complete one, especially if you are more or less around one of these bases. Uh, these these three are kind of optimal um, for doing this, so public servers might be the go-to for this, or just populated VIP servers, I guess. So, how this works is, if you go ahead and look at the Halloween event page, you can see candy color right here. What this does is, pretty much, since it is in green, I need to turn Swine Mine Ore into uh, green rock candy. With this, I put it in a rock candy center, pick up my new green uh, piece of candy, and I bring it to the giant pumpkin in this red pumpkin cave give it, and that gives me 25 points out of a thousand, so it would take you about 40 pieces of candy to finish the quest, uh, if all of them give 25, so we will see right now. Okay, uh, we are heading in. Yeah, seems to be 25 every time, okay. So you do this about 40 times, and you will get all of the items. As far as the rest of the quests, they are currently locked until their release date, which you could see right next to it. So in four days as of recording this, we will get the uh, War Quest and then the Conquest Quest. That's fun to say. The Conquest Quest uh, on the 24th, so 11 days from now. But yeah, as far as this goes right now, I'm just going to be doing this for a little bit. I will see you guys when I'm finished in like two seconds. Also, during this process, I've realized if you have this uh, sword from one of the, uh, I think, the Dark Knight Game Pass, what you could do is, over here, we're gonna try this, but we can press Z to make, like, a teleportation thing, give the piece of candy, put the sword away, All right, here's what we're gonna do. Make our piece of candy. Pick it up. X. Yep, it works. Okay, so I didn't realize that uh, the, the, the candy changed on me. So, since it's now purple, uh, I pretty much just take one of the rock candy things. Uh, this should probably it. This should probably be it. Oh, no, wait, that's... Yeah, I'm just being stupid. Okay, here it is. So now we do the same thing, just with different color. Oh, my uh, spawn thingy doesn't work anymore. You know what? Here's what I'm curious about. Hold on. I want to see if I can get even more creative here. So we're going to take... Let me get my champion infuser out, hold on. We're gonna see if I could put a spawn thing, like a teleportation thing, inside of there, so I don't even need to go through the portal each time. Hold on. 
I was just a little worried that it like might break or something, but I don't know. We'll uh, we'll see. Okay. There is that. Okay, let's head back out. This could make my runs like a bajillion times faster now, so we'll see. I've only been doing this for like five minutes anyway, so. All right, moment of truth. No, I think it. Oh no! Wait, I'm stupid. I just set. A... I'm stupid. Hold on. Okay. Uh. Oh wait. I'm... Oh my god. Okay. Set. Make. Pick up. Teleport. It does not work. Okay. That's that's unfortunate, man. That's unfortunate. That could have been the strat right there, dude. Jesus, I thought I thought I might have had something really crazy for a little bit of a second there. Jesus. All right. Uh, we're gonna keep uh, doing this then, I guess, because we've got a decent strategy as is. So I'm not really too worried about it. All right. I will see you guys when this is done. Give me a second. Okay, guys, uh, this is probably what you came here for, but I just found a cheese that works for quickly doing the uh, the quest here. So it's pretty much the same, the same thing I've been doing, where you use the Dark Knight Sword to place a, like, a teleportation thing. Place it, like, right here, right at that spot. You can do that by holding the sword and pressing Z. You make the piece you want to make, pick it up, run this way. You want to run this way, and then press X. And then immediately you get teleported in. This makes it so your runs could be so quick. I was getting two or three runs per minute. And when it's the purple one, uh, as far as I know, you get like 35 plus or something like that. I don't know. I was getting like 35, I think, each time. So just a little heads up. That's something you could do. I just finished all of my quests, but, um, yeah. Okay, as far as the rest of the update goes, I would just like to acknowledge, uh, or get you guys to acknowledge, at least, that you cannot, um, so, you cannot use, uh, rebirthing to get pumpkin boxes. They just don't work for pumpkin boxes. If you want pumpkin boxes, you're gonna have to farm them physically by three ways. Giant candy corn, mega pumpkins, or normal pumpkins. Those are the only ways to get pumpkin boxes this event. Sorry, but there is no way to do it via rebirthing. Thank you guys for watching this video, and I will see you with more content later today. Peace!